good morning students so in this class we are going to discuss about lateral magnification in spherical surface so consider an extended object o o dash is placed perpendicular to the principal axis so the ray from o dash is passes through the from one medium here r as a medium to the spherical surface so and passes through along the point that is center of curvature and creates a image at i i dash so that o o dash is a object the i i dash is a image so that lateral magnification or transverse magnification is a ratio of height of the image divided by height of the object so this is the object this image so i i dash by o o dash so those two similar triangles that is c o o dash and c i i dash that is i i dash divided by o o dash equal to c i by c o so from geometry c i by c o equal to so c i is p i minus p c then c o so c o is equal to p c plus p o so that m is equal to that is magnification i i dash by o o dash equal to c i by c o so instead of c i by c o we can write it as p i minus p c divided by p c plus p o so the sign conventions for that so i i dash is the height of a image so it's in downward is negative axis so minus h2 so o o dash positive axis so plus h1 then pi so pi is image distance so it is positive axis plus v then po is object distance so it's minus u then pc is a radius of curvature of the spherical mirror so plus r so just substitute so v minus r by r plus minus u so here m minus h2 by h1 because h2 that is in downward direction so negative axis so multiply by minus on both sides so h2 by h1 so minus of v minus r by r minus u so just multiply minus so r plus so that is minus of minus plus so r minus v by r minus u so this is the equation that yeah, magnification m is equal to h2 by h1 then r minus v by r minus u so we can derive in some other way also from the equation of sing single spherical surface so in the previous we have discussed n2 by v minus n1 by u is equal to n2 minus n1 by r so just cross multiply so n2 u minus n1 v by v u then just rearrange you will get the radius of curvature r is equal to n2 minus n1 into u so the r so here it goes downwards that v u goes upwards so that n2 minus n1 u by n2 u minus n1 v after that so here r minus v by r minus u so just r minus u here minus u then calculate again r minus v so again minus v if you put then if you substitute here you will get n1 v by n2 u so we can find the magnification that is lateral magnification using height of the object then height of the image and also from the refractive indexes so of two media and the object distance and image distance so if we know the radius of curvature we can find using this formula so r minus v by r minus u in the question they have given the refractive index of the two medium then object distance image distance you need to use this formula so there are two formulas for finding the lateral magnification so m is equal to r minus v by r minus u here in terms of refractive index n1 v by n2 u so in this class we are discuss so lateral magnification in spherical surface so the extended object placed perpendicular to the principal axis then the image is formed at i i dash so from this we have derived the lateral magnification